everyone welcome back to my channel and good morning so we are today on a Sunday morning and there's a lot of clouds and I'm really so happy about that because as you know uh, when we are in spring we finally started to see beautiful colors I wanted to go actually uh, one week or two weeks ago but this, the colors weren't so beautiful like today the trees were still a little bit empty today is not so full but at least we 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 have the the color of spring this beautiful green soft green color that i really love so much so i was saying that today is so cloudy and i like this situation a lot in spring for example or in autumn because we want soft light to see the beautiful color we don't want harsh light from the sun for example uh, that's why I like in spring or in autumn to be heavily cloudy for example or to be foggy or the last uh, possibility for example to take photos during sunlight or sunset to have the you know the gold beautiful color anyway as I was walking here I am uh, by the way on the exact same place where I was taking uh, insect macro photos uh, last video but today the place looks more beautiful because of the green color the soft green of the spring as I was walking here actually the, the scene is so chaotic uh, there's a lot of chaos 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 <laughs> there's a lot of chaos and trees branched everywhere but as I was walking I just found it's not so fantastic photo but I wanted I wanted actually to start my day <laughs> with this photo with the hope that I can find something better but I, I really, I, w I wanted to, you know, just leave it and, and go away. But I feel that something told me, try to take a photo here. So this is the photo that I was talking about. I don't know actually what is the specific reason that makes me interested in this scene. But I feel these three trees are making so like harmony or something like that. And these two trees, how they are bending to the left side of the photo, I feel, I feel I can make something here. So let's try that and see the results. And the reason that I was using a CBL filter, I think I don't have to mention that every time. As you know, in spring or in autumn, we want the color to be so vibrant. And they are made CBL filter for this reason. To take off reflections, obviously, but at the same time, I think it's so fantastic to make the colors more vibrant. So, let's continue walking and search for something else. So I was I was walking here and I found this small beautiful bath as you can see. So here is a fence and behind this fence is actually a private area but I I didn't find any sign that uh, written for example that I'm not allowed to come here because uh, the road is open for everyone and I didn't find any sign that is written on I'm not allowed to come here. Anyway I am outside the private area as you can see there's a fence but I really like this small bus and I was actually I was driving on the other on the other side of the river there's a small river here and I was driving on the other side and I found as I was driving there I found this small bus and I, I actually I wasn't here I haven't been here this is the first time I come here to this path and I, I like the the trees here as you can see the trees above the the fence itself the fence the fence itself and this small path if you know me you saw in my old videos you know that I am so attracted to small bath when there's a small bath with a lot of trees and yeah, yeah I like I like that a lot so what I want to try I think I will go back something like here and I will try to 
take the photo with the 7300 millimeter lens I want to zoom in to cut everything else I just want the path I'm not sure if I want to show the fence only I want to show this small path with the trees on the both sides of this path so as you can see I was standing exactly right here I took actually more than one photo the first one I was I think something like 70 millimeter and the second one I tried to zoom in a little bit to take off this tree here and the fence at the same time and the last two photos I zoomed out a little bit and I tried to a different focus point in this photo for example I was focusing to the infinity or to the last subject to the far subject from the lens and this the second one here I was focusing a little bit at the beginning to try to make the background a little bit soft and a little bit out of focus and I will see them on the screen of my laptop and decide which one I like the most After I packed up my my gears and I decided I want to go back home, I couldn't find something specific. But I was walking here and I found a very, I would call it calm and so simple scene. Actually, it's so simple. There is nothing so specific. But I like the harmony of the trees and the green color of the spring, the green color of the grass on the ground. I just I, I wanted to, to give it a try I I feel the photo is so calm and so beautiful the scene actually is so simple I just like the bath here the group of the trees at the background as you can see it's it's really so so normal and I'm taking the photo with my uh, Sigma ultra wide angle lens but I'm taking it at 20 millimeter lens because 20 millimeter sorry my lens is that the 10 20 millimeter lens and I'm taking the photo at 20 millimeters because I don't want to show the sky I just want the concentration to be only the trees and the bus I don't want to show the sky there's a little bit of the sky of sky in the photo but obviously not like taking the photo at 10 millimeter lens at 10 millimeter again I'm saying lens again So at the end of today's video, thanks a lot for watching. These were all the photos for today. I hope you like the video. I hope you like the photos. Thanks a lot for watching. Please consider subscribing if you are not already. And see you in the next video. Bye.